and we went down to New Orleans where, as it happened, Led Zeppelin were in town and that's where they were staying while they flew to other places. And uh, we stayed there. Yeah, like common in the day. Right. Yeah, yeah. And then, uh, then we drove to New York and on the way to New York, the Mercer Arts Center fell down. Yeah, I was going to ask you about that. So, I mean, you, 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 the reason you were going back to New York is because you had heard that there was a scene starting up. That's and, right. Uh, and you got there, and, and, and the Mercer comes tumbling down. I guess the New York Dolls scene kind of morphs into something different, and that leads you to Terry Ork's uh, Chinatown flat, right? Well, not quite so quickly. Um, I arrived in New York and uh, the Mercer Art Center had fallen down, but I quickly found out that Max's Kansas City was the hot spot for all the everybody, right. artists, you know, Warhol people, uh, musicians, etc. And the, the back room, which was this very small space, actually, with a number of tables and booths in it was like the place to be. And you couldn't get in there just uh, on your good looks alone. So I don't know how I managed to become one of the regulars. I guess I was pretty boy at the time. And so- <laughs> There is that, there is that. They wanted uh, me around, you know, and so wild I was- child, Wild child probably helps too. The wild child definitely helped. And, uh, you know, I went to, uh, and I had no home. And I, you know, lived with a number of girls and uh, and boys and uh, did what I could to survive while playing my guitar unelectrified. Unelectrified by yourself. By myself. Yeah. Well, there's yeah. nothing wrong with that. No. I mean, but, yeah, but how many years is this that you are you know, woodshedding alone. Well, 17 to 26. Yeah, 10 years. That's a long time to just buy yourself so that you don't get, let us say, infected by other right. people's playing. But it does create a, a certainly a sense of originality. I would hope so. Oh, it definitely it shows through uh, in your plane. I think that's pretty obvious. Uh, so, yeah, which is why I don't get hired for a lot of gigs because people want guitarists who don't upset the whatever it is, the apple cart that's going. They're like the lead vocalist is famous and he wants a guitarist that sounds just it sounds really good, but like a neutral taste. No, no, you know, like Jimmy Hendrix. Well, I was going to say, Jimmy had that problem a lot. He had that problem a lot. <laughs> yeah, he got kicked out because he... Several he, times, right. Yeah. I don't want that to happen. <laughs> 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 to me.